there were some people trying to get around the guidelines and stuff. Um, and I think you and I see eye to eye with this. It's don't don't mess with the rules there, especially yeah. in the VA handbook. I would say out of all the rules and regulations of different loan programs, one, the VA handbook is the smallest compared to any other rule and regulation book by by nearly half, honestly. And then the other thing too is the VA handbook is so cut and dry on your left and right limits. Seeing people try to kind of go around it was pretty funny. Um, yeah, it's ridiculous. I, yeah, so I think, you know, with those three options, right, I don't see it being rolled into the loan. It really makes no sense. I think it would it would either hurt the buyer if, they, if they're keen time to sell, you know, depending on how the market moves. The concessions could be easily changed in the VA handbook, but the easiest way that I see it is just allowing that veteran to make that decision if they want to pay their agent's commission because the seller is no longer doing it after the NAR settle. Yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, you know, there's not a whole lot more room for speculation. 